Gaza. Now, the Department of Justice has filed a lawsuit against Live Nation in hopes to break up the company. The lawsuit says that a monopoly to buy Ticketmaster and its parent company, Live Nation, drives up ticket prices for fans and hurts competition. The DOJ also alleges Live Nation uses unfair practices to keep venues locked into long-term exclusive contracts. The lawsuit is being brought along with 30 state and district attorney generals, including Arkansas Attorney General. Attorney General Tim Griffin, United States Attorney General Mary Garland says that Live Nation's monopoly costs fans more in fees and leaves venues with few other choices for ticket sales. Our complaint makes clear what happens when a monopolist dedicates its resources to entrenching its monopoly power and insulating itself from competition rather than investing in better products and services. We allege that Live Nation has illegally monopolized markets across the live concert industry in the United States for far too long. Live Nation denies it engages in unfair or illegal practices and says this lawsuit will fail in court. Ticketmaster is the largest ticket seller, handling around 70% of all U.S. concert ticket sales.